what go on my people for all of who've been following Mr. Vegas soap opera turn suspense. So recently, people, Mr. Vegas was a videographer of a, a resident he was lodging. You know what I mean? And he was one of the videographers who caught it on video. He up sent it to a friend according to him. The friend uploaded to social media. And when the friend uploaded to social media, he was being bashed by a lot of people, by, by fans, by people like Conscience, and some other people where he defend himself bashing Conscience, calling Conscience a host nigga. You know what I mean? We have some exclusive, more footage of the video. This is from the King Alarm people, where King Alarm released the video. One is from the building and I think one is from the supervisor. You know what I mean? We're gonna watch it and we come back and discuss this video in its entirety. Okay, so the time on the clock is 6.22.36. It's a double speed just to make all the recording time. Um, this is the initial approach of gentleman in the white shirt to the security house. Um, good evening, sir. Say your name again, please. Right, I am T73 at Police Emergency. This is T73? Yes. Okay, sir. Um, we, I'm calling from King Alarm. My name is Andrew Gordon. Yes. We have a situation at um, 17 Braemar Avenue. Um, the name of the location is Braemar Estate, where um, it, it's, a whole, it's, a, it's a complex, and the security guard was physically assaulted by one of the residents, which including him being gun butted. Yes, yes, sir. Braemar Estate, 17 Braemar Avenue. Our response team is there now, and they are requesting your presence. What, what, can I get a complaint? Um, complaint, and well, it is the team that, well, we didn't speak to anyone there. We just got the alert, and we dispatched our team, and the team is there now, and they reported to us that. The security guard was 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 being up. Um, no, no, yet the team has not given us that. I'm not sure that they must have seen the name of this person. Okay, what's your name? My name is Andrew Gordon, sir. Okay, Mr. Gordon. All right, that's the contact for now. Yes. Um, can I have a contact number for you? Nine two six zero one one six. Okay, no problem. I'll be much. Much appreciated, sir. Thank All right, you. Sir. All right. Well, you can't throw me a car, no. Them person. Them? Evelyn. Yeah, can we have a situation here? I call the security. Yeah? Yes. I was the one who called the security. Take off the lock. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Sir. The police matter this now. No? You're a police? Well, they come in. So we're not. Yeah, but you can't hold. You can't, dis you can't decide to take the gate. No, no, no. security and the people come in here and hold gun them up right to do the matter still. Because people assaulted the, the security. Yes. The gun. Yo, take off the lock. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't hold the hostage. King, what's happening, man? Hold on, hold on. 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 Bravo, one one. 
Close the trunk. Close the trunk and drive up the car. Bravo, one one. You can't hold people hostage. We are not hostage. Oh, you see? Yo, 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 I don't know. 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 I don't I bet you lose your job. Oh, relax yourself. Bet you lose the job. You point your gun right now. Bravo, you can't have the knees of assistance. You're going to your corner here now. Hey, wait a minute. Yo, call that big man. Where in the tail? Calm down, sister. Calm down. Calm down, sister. Calm down. Relax yourself, man. No check to you. No check to you. I don't mean that you. I don't mean that you. I don't mean that you. You lick off the job. You are lick off the You cannot. 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 You Look how we are talking Sister, how are you? Relax yourself, man. Relax yourself, man. Okay? Come on. So, so. Yo, hold on, hold on, hey, 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 hey. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm going to go for you. I'm going to go for you. Easy, easy. Easy. Yeah, hey, put on your gun. Put on your gun. Put on your gun. Hey, put on your gun. Hey, put on your gun. Put on your gun. Hey, put on your gun. 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 Put on your Yo, yo, put a hand on the gun, Mister No. Yo, big man, put a hand on. Yo, put a hand on. Put a hand on, big man. Yes, I'm put a hand on. 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 Put
Ayo. Just follow me, man. Who's it? Basta. Fire on him. We don't dead. I want to put the police camera there. Hello? Yeah. That man love brown, 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 knife and that thing, you know. Ignorant, white man. Yes, <laughs> no, the man said, you have a phone, stand up over the so you have a phone, just stay out there, you have a phone, you have a phone, you have a phone, you stay out there, you just not here, you don't you don't know, 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 you where the gun? Where the gun? Where the gun? You have it? The camera is there. Where the gun? The camera is there. Carpal! Carpal! So we have to do this. 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 We have to do so people as you all can see that is the next footage of the video and as far as I see the story is still developing it's an unraveling story because video footage just keep coming out it's the first I ever see, seen so many cameras in one place in Jamaica showing multiple different angles you know what I mean it's very interesting because right now the story that's developing at first everybody was bashing Vegas but seeing these people I personally have to side with Vegas you know what I mean because it looked like this situation was provoked by that um, gentleman with the gun because he was licking off the gate and the security guard was telling him not to and he was saying that he was being held at hostage and I don't see a hostage situation because According to um, the developing of the story, and it's like the security was gun bought by the, that guy in the red shirt. You know what I mean? And that red shirt guy is look like the the um the red shirt guy is the one who the businessman who is trying to get out the building or the property. You know what I mean? So he's trying to get him out of the property and in doing so he's defending him and defending him with a gun. So I think the guy in the red shirt called the one with the gun to get him off the property after bun gun butting him. You know what I mean? I don't know how the story go but this is my analysis of the story. And, and next thing people, they're saying, King Alarm is saying that they're going to tra train the security in human rights issue. Why are they going to train them in human, human rights? I don't think it's a human right. Profen professionalism. You know what I mean? Because I, as far as watching the video and from my analysis of the video people, I think they lack professionalism. You know what I mean? Because why are they acting like that? They, this guy should have been in handcuffs all this time. Because if that was the case, this it wouldn't have reached to all of this. You know what I mean? But... I didn't know this is how the story went and for all the people them that's bashing Vegas I think they can actually say that Vegas was right because I, for, for me watching the video that's why you should not just jump to conclusion and that's the moral of this story while it developed you cannot jump to a conclusion unless you see the entire story because 
everybody was bashing Vegas, including me. You know what I mean? But watching this video, you can see that Vegas have a point that they are trying to, to um, assault this guy. And I think the guy in the red shirt and the guy with the gun should be charged for assault and not encouraging the security guard to um, jump on the guy with the gun because that's life threatening. You know what I mean? Because you cannot see a man and just think you're going to rush a man with a gun and think it's going to end like that because if a man has a gun, he's trained to have it. You know what I mean? Unless he's just stupid. You see me? So the guy with the gun should be charged with assault and the guy in the red shirt should be charged with assault as far as I see. You know what I mean? And if this the security guard did, I don't know how far this case is going to go. But as I said, people, the case is still developing and it's interesting. I don't know if Vegas is going to find any more event to attend. But all I know, Vegas is in the middle of everything. You know what I mean? So big up to all of the viewers. And while this, this story keeps developing, we're going to keep everyone updated. Peace. I'm out.